Dear students, I welcome you in the course of Leadership, Emotional Intelligence and Decision Making. This is module number 73 and we are going to talk about that we have to be innovative, we have to act with creativity and that creativity is going to give us the leadership leap. When we talk about the leadership leap, remember we have to focus the four domains. The four domains which are actually comprising us, which are actually part of ourselves and which are there to tell you that what is your relationship in this existing world. Therefore, remember one thing that the leadership leap is basically that sometimes you have to jump into the hearts and minds of your stakeholders because unless and until you don't put yourself in their shoe, you would not be able to find out the real cause and effect. You would not be able to find out the real perspectives in which they are actually existing. So, be careful that sometimes you have to put all your effort to get the motivation, to get the right way of doing the things. The second important thing which you have to bear in your mind is that leadership motto should be, it's all about you, it's about caring, the, uh, caring about the other person, it's about focusing on the other person, it's about knowing the needs, wants, emotions of the other person because unless and until you don't focus, you don't pay attention to the other people, it will be difficult for them to find out the right ways of interacting with you. The third thing is that we have to be as a leader need to know that leaders see the world through the eyes of the others. Again, you have to put yourself in their shoe. You have to become their eyes. How do they perceive the things? And you have to understand their perception. As I always say that first try to understand then to be understood because unless and until you are not giving the time and attention to understand what others are trying to think about, it would be difficult for them to think what you are trying to say. The fourth perspective is that the leaders are always talking about we rather than it's just me. So, a leader is someone who is actually from among us, a leader is someone who is talking about the holistic perspectives. A leader is someone who is talking about the collective efforts, the collective existence. Therefore, the leadership leap is also requiring from you to make people more involved so that they feel participative, they feel that their existence is not just a wastage and as if they are also contributing towards the success of the whole team, of the whole group. The leadership leap would also require from you to do for others. You do need to create to take care of yourself as well because unless and until you don't take care of yourself, you will be exhausted, you will be demotivated or usse dusron ki bhi jo energies hongi wo compromise ho jayengi. Therefore, to do for others, you need to focus on yourself because jab tak aapki existence hai, tabhi tak aap leadership role mein wahaan par kaam wo kar sakenge. The third most important thing is that new ways of doing things is a very important concept because new ways of doing things may aap new avenues wo explore kar paate ho and that can be even the part and parcel of the leadership vision because leadership vision is ke bagair incomplete hogi jab tak aap creativity or innovation ka sahara wo nahi le rahe ho. The fourth thing is that focus on higher purpose, focus on higher priorities see what is actually required from you. Dear students, agar hume sari baat ko conclude karein, to yaad rakhiye ga ke hume apni four domains ko ek equitable balance mein wo lekar chalna hai. Aur us equitable balance mein humne unko bhi importance deni hai aur apni existence ko bhi wo ensure karna hai. Isi tarike se us energy ko hum sa energy mein convert kar sakenge jo ke ek team ki requirement hai. Thank you.